Nicholson, Amori at center court. The Big Ten regular season finale. Let's ride. Alley oop, what a start! Mulcahy top shelf to Cliff Amori. Cliff Amori, 67 dunks now on the season. Oh. And a rejection on the other end. Out of bounds, and that went off of Audige. It belongs to the Scarlet Knights. And that loss Thursday at Minnesota pushed them closer to the bubble, although every major bracketologist still has them in the field. And that man is in the bucket, Cam Spencer from way downtown. You do something too crazy, you don't want to aggravate that back. Yeah, it's, you said it's been an issue for him. Meanwhile, Ty Berry has all five points for the Cats. 6-0 run here for the Cats over the last three minutes. Good cross-court skip. It's a 9-0 run after the Chase Audige three-pointer. Tell you what, these Cats. Simpson can't get it off the shot fake. Palmquist comes flying through. Northwestern wanted to travel, and after all that, Simpson scores it, and he's fouled. Wow. Looking to see what they can get. He's giving. He's using his platform for a wonderful cause. So big ups to Paul Mulcahy. He knows his role. He does not get outside of himself. He does a really good job like this. Wow, back-to-back -back dunks. And what a feed from Audine. Barry driving kick. Barnheiser spinning. High Ooh. off the glass. Brooks Barnheiser with eight. Boy, he's got that strut. Then he coming down the court. the first of 50 in this game. It might be the first of 40. Yeah, you may be right. Barnheiser becomes the first player in double figures. Well, we talk so much about Caleb McConnell's defense, but Audige has been spectacular defensively this year. He's got to be in the mix for Defensive Player of the Year in the conference as well. Audige splits him. Amore got a hand on it, but look at the follow by Matthew Nicholson. That's what's crazy. Boo Booey and Chase Audige, one field goal, three points between them. But guys like this have stepped up. What a night for Brooks Barnheiser. He has 13. Oh, good look. Barnheiser attacks. Two more. Uh, they're going to have to force the issue offensively because Mulcahy has lost all confidence. Well, there's Simpson splitting the defenders and banking it home. Cam Spencer, oh my goodness, with the left of Maury and the foul. Five straight games and double figures for the sophomore from Lafayette, Indiana, who did not get offered by Purdue IU. And Nicholson, who's also had a nice night with another rejection, his fourth. His offensive versatility is what's really missing, because he would be on the offensive glass, be able to do some different things. Let, yeah, good feed, Mulcahy into a boring. Garrett Simpson lost one of his shoes there, but got it back. And to the bucket, Boo Booey. A no whistle. And now Adige getting down here. Oh, top fourth dunk of the night for Matthew Nichols. Boy, Amore has had difficult getting that ball out of that track. Simpson can't hit it. They save it, though. There's Amore. Maybe that'll give him a jolt of energy. Barnheiser, way too much. Simpson. Inside, there's Amore again. Where was the defense? Precision offense by Northwest. Bowie in the A range, and now Boo Bowie in front of his friends and family, starting to feel comfortable. These two teams have gotten hot. Between the two of them, they've made nine of the last ten shots. Now Bowie with his third three of the second half and another stare down. Meanwhile, Spencer steals it back. Mulcahy lays it in. Here's McConnell. Around the arc it goes, but that defense so good for Northwestern until that moment. Good pass to Amore. 
Final seconds, Northwestern, what an impressive way to cap such an impressive regular season. The Cats will be the two seed in Chicago.